Hi! Welcome to today's video. I just wanted to do a quick review on a pair, actually a bunch of pairs of lashes that I bought off of Amazon. I thought that would be really fun because everybody loves fake, well, most of us love false lashes and I'm always looking for like the best pair of lashes and even though I work for MAC, I don't particularly like their lashes that they carry, so I'm often looking elsewhere to find really, really awesome eyelashes, and I fell in love with the Ardell lashes because they're really, really soft and fluffy, and I just love them, but I cannot keep spending $10 on every single pair of lashes that I buy. It's just too much. So the other day I was thinking, um, well, Amazon has absolutely everything, so why not check Amazon to see if they have any really fun lashes? Oh my God, my hair is doing like a woohoo thing, and... Okay, sorry. Um, okay, yeah, so I just wanted to quickly review the eyelashes that I got. And I might like actually put them on because I noticed that it looks like I have no lashes at all, even natural. So the first pair that I got were these Alice eyelashes. Um, so these cost around $13 or $14 on Amazon. And the reason why I picked them when I looked at ooh, the picture was because they actually look a lot like the Ardell lashes that I normally buy. So this is what they look like. So that's just one pair, but actually it comes with three, which for $13, that's such a steal. So that was like, add to cart, buying those. Um, so they're really, really fluffy and soft. They've got lots of like cool angles to them. So they're a bit more unique than the traditional, just like straight out eyelash. They're so friggin' bold, which is exactly what I like. Um, the only thing that I don't like about them is it looks like the band is really thick. I don't know if you can tell there on the screen. Um, so that can get a little bit uncomfortable because then it can poke you and sometimes they're a little bit stiff to put on. Um, but it's worth it because they're so beautiful and they were $13 for three pairs. Okay, so that's the first one and I'll try those on in a minute. I'll do like one on each eye. So the next batch of lashes that I got are by Coop. Cookie, yours? Uh, cookie, yours, I think. I don't know. Um, this is what the box looks like. I like these ones because they looked really, really bold. And they were around the same price, but for 10 freaking pairs. 10 pairs. So I was instantly like, add that to my cart because they looked really good and you get 10 for like 15 bucks. So this is what, they came in these individual little pack. They're really long. You can see that, like super, super long. So I really wanted them for their length and they're more of like that classic look, just like straight out opposed to these ones, which are kind of like crazy and all over the place and they're more like unique lashes. Um, these ones are also pretty soft, but they're not as thick as the other ones. Um, but I think I'm gonna really like these because the band is smaller on this one than the other one. So there's like benefits and drawbacks to both. Yeah. So a brief comparison to the MAC lashes because I had just said that I prefer um, other brands because I don't particularly like the materials that the MAC lashes are made out of. And the variety, there's just not much variety of like ones that I love. So I usually, my go-to ones are the 48s or the 36s. I don't have a pair of those right now. And I actually like to stack them together because I don't find that they're bold enough. Now to compare, so like the MAC lashes are really stiff and they almost feel like gritty. I like literally feel like I want to like run conditioner through these lashes because they're kind of like, they're just rough and I don't really like them. Um, they're also all just like one straight length across. So in the inner corner, it tends to like poke you like on the side of the nose and like you're always like, itching um but i so i like more of like a a little bit of a transition from like shorter to longer so sometimes i actually end up like cutting them on the inner corners just to give me that look that i want um yeah and so like here's just like a side by side see like the differences in the boldness and that's why i have to stack these ones together is because i want something more like this Fuck! or like this um because they're super bold and i it's much easier so i'm gonna throw these on so we'll be right back and I'll show you what they each look like. So 
here are my thoughts. This is what they look like. I've got one on here, one different one on here. Um, so what I think is I'm absolutely in love with these ones. Um, I just love like the shape of these ones. I love the look of them. They're so friggin' soft. The band isn't as thick as I thought it was looking in the box. Um, and putting them on was a lot easier than I thought it was gonna be because I initially thought the band was really thick, but now it's not. Um, I had to cut them a little bit, uh, which is fine because I usually do. They went on super easily and they feel really nice. They're not poking me anywhere. So these ones definitely get like a positive review. And the other ones, which I thought I was gonna like better, um, I don't know. Really, I, I'm not in love with them because they don't look very nice. Well, they look okay. I had to cut the inside because it was like poking my nose and they looked really fake and like cheap all one length. It was weird. And they're really, really shiny. So they look really plasticky, um, which is really sad because I was excited about these ones because I got literally 10. Um, the band on these ones is a lot thicker than I thought that they were and it was super hard to put on. They're also poking me a little bit so they're not very comfortable. So yeah, I'm not sure how much I like these. Like I am gonna wear them because I have them and I'm gonna try and make them look as good as I can. Yeah, so in terms of advice for purchasing lashes on Amazon, don't go for the lashes that come with a million pairs just because you're excited about the amount. In this case, quantity, is not better even though they were cheaper so I'd definitely go with these ones over these guys um, I hope that you enjoyed or found this helpful if you're thinking of ordering some lashes on Amazon um, I'll probably still do it because they're they have really cheap ones that are super nice and I'm too cheap now to buy anything that is expensive and I'm very excited to try some new pairs I guess I don't know but I probably won't need to for a while because I have 13 pairs to get through. But yeah, so um, that's all for today. Have a great day, and hopefully I will be back on with some other videos soon. Don't forget to throw in a little like, definitely comment, and subscribe. Bye.